Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Guess who got a mount yesterday? Or it came in the via Amazon yesterday. Good morning. So now I'm just kind of playing with like where I want to put the mount in my car. Good morning. So yesterday my mount came in. So we went karaoke yesterday on here. I took you guys cruising with me just for a little bit. I took you guys cruising with me from work to Hot Hula. So that was fun. We got to do some terrible singing and some, I think I, did I do some rapping? I don't remember. It might still be on here because I did it yesterday afternoon after work, like four something. So that was super fun. So <laughs> this mount, I think I'm gonna like it better than the other one. It has like a bendy, like a really thick bendy thingy and it clamps like there's a like a clip for you to open up like a jaws clamp and clamp it to stuff so we'll see I have to figure out where I'm gonna put it because yesterday I just like clipped it to my cup holder so I think when I was driving I don't know if you get motion sickness you might have got car sick <laughs> So now I have to remember to like bring my ma my um my little selfie light because now I can actually put my phone in the car as opposed to balancing it on my knee and using the sunlight or parking garage light. So I have to put I've been bad about putting my eyebrow lately. In the mornings so now you guys get to sit with me while I put my eyebrow also besides my lips good morning so how was everybody's Wednesday my hot hula Wednesday was uber fun during the holidays like a lot of people get busy they have like Christmas parties or they're shopping so typically, holidays classes are usually a little smaller. But it worked out good because then for the ladies that did come to class, they wanted to work on, like there's some things that they want to work on. They don't think that they do it well. So they kind of felt like they had like a little, they felt like it was a private lesson because then they don't have too many people in the in the group X room so they don't feel too intimidated. Not that they're intimidated, but just that, you know, they got a little bit extra attention yesterday. So that was fun too. That's always fun to do. Yesterday I used, yesterday I used purple ring, which as I told you ladies is a beautiful color. I haven't worn that one in a while. But now I'm like, what do I want to wear today? Because it's Thursday. Like I get all excited on Wednesdays because that's my hot hula day. And then I'm like, oh, yay, what can we do? Let's do something bright and blah, blah, blah. And then come Thursday, I'm like, ah, oh, can we have a do-over of Wednesday? <sighs> What to do, what to do, what to wear, what to wear, what to wear. So I'm trying to remember what songs I sang yesterday too on the drive home. Oh, I haven't worn this color in forever. Because this one recently came back in stock. So let's do an ombre. Let's ombre. I haven't worn this color in like forever. This was one of the first colors that I had when I became a distributor. And then when I ran out, she never came back. Well, she didn't come back in stock. And then it wasn't one of the colors of 2017. So recently they brought her back. This is Summer Sunset. So I'm gonna do, I know the lighting's terrible this morning. Sorry, ladies. Summer Sunset. She's a pretty corally pink. And I'm, of course, I'm going to ombre her with my favorite, Coco. 
So let's give it a go. So now I don't have to balance my mount on my knee. But it was funny yesterday. I'm I'm wearing my noisy windbreaker jacket. It's like it was so cold. It was windy this morning, or it is windy this morning. So I wore my windbreaker jacket that's like all fuzzy on the inside so it's nice and warm. But then I sound like I'm noisy, like like I'm crispy. I'm so crispy. I'm so crispy. My jean 900 shoes, 850. That's ridiculous, yeah? Who pays $900 for jeans? Is it gonna walk for you? Does it give you a permanent beautiful booty? I doubt it. 900. $850 shoes, that's nuts too. People get crazy over shoes. There's, um, I didn't know this, but until I started working at my job. But shoe places like Foot Locker and like Shoe Palace and stuff, they do um, like shoe releases. They're not the ones that does it, but like people that make shoes like Michael Jordan and whomever else. They make shoe releases because they'll bring out like a new style of shoe. And people, I'm not even kidding, people will line up at the butt crack of dawn. They'll get in line before stores even open, before the mall doors even open. People are standing in line. I mean, people, they get nuts over these shoes. And then these shoes are like super expensive. Like, they're usually expensive. And then so these people that stand in line, they'll stand in line for the shoe. And then the same day, as soon as if they were lucky enough to get a shoe, because usually when they do shoe releases, only get like freaking 10 at the store. But they'll do these shoe releases and the people that get them, a lot of times they'll resell them on like Craigslist or eBay. Or even now that Facebook has like buy and sell places. I'll see it and they'll jack up the price like triple and you'd be surprised I'm sure there's people that buy them crazy I don't think I own any like really expensive shoes I think the most expensive shoe I bought was when I compete. I think my shoe was like 75 bucks or something. I'm too pocky. I'm going to be stepping in the dirt. What if I step in doo-doo or something like, and then my shoe will get dirty. Then what? Then I'm going to be all irritated. And a lot of these shoes, when they come out, these shoe releases, they're like plastic. They're not even nice. I'm like retro. Who wants to pay $300 for a retro shoe? And I, and $300, that's being like conservative. They're actually, some of them are even more. So I'm doing my ombre this morning. So I did one line of cocoa. Now I'm going to fill her with summer sunset. She's really pretty. Let's go. But yeah, people get crazy over shoes. And then the, the shoe places started having to do like lottery ticket kind of stuff I don't even I don't know if that works any better because people would start like beefing in line or then like you know people would be in line and then leave their stuff and then try to go to the bathroom and then when they come back like other people get mad like oh no what move your feet lose your seat <laughs> oh summer sunset I haven't worn this color since it came back in stock and I've had her now for a good while but I I have so many options that I don't you know I'll get to it when I get to it summer sunset's really really pretty she's gonna be extra pretty in the spring but I figure, what the hey? There's no rule to what colors you can and cannot wear during any season. Don't be bougie. Wear the pretty color. Second coat.
It sounds like it's busy here. Oh, it is. They came to pick up the open top. Oh my goodness. We used to have, should I even say the name of the company? So a lot of places, you know how like businesses, they have like those open top bins, those really big trash bins. So there's this one company that has bins over here and they used to have this one driver. I'm not even exaggerating. The freaking guy would come into the parking garage speeding. And when I mean speeding, I mean like, Brother man is not touching brakes, all gas. He would whip it into the parking garage area. And then he would like pull in. And then without braking, he would like freaking fast and furious. What they call that when they slide? Damn, my mind went blank. But he would whip the turn, reverse without... I'm not even exaggerating. When I saw him do that the first time, I was like, what the heck? He whipped it in, spun around, reverse, pick up the, the bin, and and now because he's facing out of the garage, like he's facing the direction he came in, now he just speed out of the out of the parking garage. Not this guy, these people is good, the ones that are here right now. But this other company, I'll I'll not say their name. It starts with an R. But they the freaking driver would do that and I'm like what the heck like good thing nobody was walking or never have you know sometimes get tatas and nanas walking around early in the morning with their dogs and stuff like oh my gosh so then i went into the office that day and i was like holy crap the blah 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 guy came to pick up the bin and he went whip him he went whip him through the, through the parking garage and then they're like oh yeah that guy with the such and such truck i'm like yeah i said does he do that all the time and then even my co-workers are like oh yeah that's how he drives in there like we even look at him like, um, can you slow down? I saw him do that twice. Same guy. I haven't seen him lately, but I don't know if we still use that company. But that guy was crazy. I'm not even exaggerating. He'd whip him, turn it reverse, and whip it out the garage with the bin. Sketchy looking guy. Try not to judge people by what they look like, but the guy looked like how I'm describing how he drove. crazy crazy I'm really liking this summer sunset again I haven't worn her in forever I want to say the last time I wore this color was like February or March I'm not even exaggerating ah so I'm gonna line one more time these guys is good So remember ladies, when you ombre, you line and blend. And when I say blend, like I just draw little lines. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Cause it's liquid. So you just kind of touch with your brush. So when you ombre, you line one time and blend, then you fill two times in the empty space with your lighter color. Then you line and blend one more time. See, my jacket is so noisy. I sound crispy. I'm so crispy. I'm so crispy. What songs did I sing yesterday? I sang a Yellow Man song. What else did I sing? Mi Gente was my last song. <laughs> I didn't do a very good job of singing that song because I don't know the words. And then I said, they could be swearing at me, but it sounds pretty. So it might still be on here. Ooh. Oh, ladies, I like this color. Don't be afraid to use colors that people would normally label as spring or summer. Because colors should not be only for certain times of the year. Mind you, there's some colors that are just a little more festive. But I like this one. I did a, 
I did a coco. I did an ombre with coco and summer sunset. Now I just gonna cover her with gloss. I have to, I need to bring my little selfie light, but that one is so bright. But I think I'm gonna like this mount. Maybe we can go karaoke more often. We went karaoke yesterday. If you didn't catch it, watch it before it disappears because I didn't, um, I didn't save that one. Oh, I just cover her with gloss. I feel so nice. So pretty, like model, cheerleader. Maybe not like model or anything. I was a cheerleader though. Oh, I think that I found myself a cheerleader. She is always right there when I need her. Don't ask me where I remember all these songs from and because I don't know how I do it. And I don't know why I do it. I just do. Uber fun. But now I am ready for my day. I got my Coco and Summer Sunset Ombre. I cut my mouth. I'm super happy. So now I don't have to balance it on my knee so I don't have to like be all stuck in my door. Because that's how I would do it. I would push my knee up against my door and then balance my phone on my knee. Which that can be fun sometimes too. But in case you guys wonder what that noise is, it's my flask. But I have a little pineapple thingy, so when I walk, it'll... I love my flask. Thanks, champ. <laughs> oh my goodness, speaking of champ. You guys have to watch his Christmas... Um, Christmas edition of the champ show. Hello. I got lucky enough to get a sneak peek. No, I'm not on it, but I, I did get a sneak peek. And it's super funny. You know he's always funny. There, it's never a dull moment with with him and Johnny. Hilaire. But now I gotta go to work. I never like come to work today, guys. My alarm went off and I said, all I wanna do is sleep. It was so windy. Like the wind was just coming through the house. Super cold. Perfect weather to stay in, have a cup of cocoa or coconut coffee, if that's if that's your thing, because that's my thing. But I didn't want to get up and come in today. And then I was like, oh. if my son has to get up and go to school all the way in Kalihi and get up the same time as I do, I can't get up, drop him off and take my butt back home and go sleep. That's like totally mean. So I couldn't do it. I'm like, okay, never mind. Suck it up, buttercup. Let's get in there. Get this day done. I don't know. Maybe if I can figure out where to put this mount in my car as I drive. Maybe I'll take you guys karaoke again today. Who knows what kind of songs they're going to be playing. And I channel surf. So we had different kind of music. We had modern. I love to learn the new songs, you know. Just so I can terrorize my kids, the teenagers. <laughs> they're, they're all like teenagers. Now like my big kids are having kids. Which one of them started walking. I saw her video. I was so excited. I'm going to go back and watch her video again. Just so I can bring some sunshine to my freaking gloomy dark day. Don't be a gloom and doom. Be a ray of sunshine. Love you guys. Throw some shakas. Maybe I'll see you later. Tita got them out. Mm -hmm.